castle in the park. Once upon a time, in the land of Hushabai, around about the wondrous days of yore, they came across a sort of box, bound up with chains and locked with locks, and labeled, kindly do not touch, it's war. A decree was issued round about, all with a flourish and a shout, the gaily colored mascot tripping lightly on before. Don't fiddle with this deadly box, or break the chain, or pick the locks. And please, don't ever play about with war. Well, the children understood. Children happened to be good, and were just as good around the time of yore. They didn't try to pick the locks, or break into the deadly box, and never try to play about with war. Mommies didn't either. Sisters, aunts, nor grannies neither. Because they were quiet, and sweet, and pretty, in those wondrous days of yore. Well, very much the same as now, and not the ones to blame somehow for opening up that deadly box of war. But someone did. Someone battered in the lid and spilled the insides out across the floor. A sort of bouncy, bumpy ball made up of flags and guns and all the tears and horror and the death that goes with war. It bounced right out and went bashing all about and bumping into everything in store. And what was sad and most unfair was that it didn't really seem to care much who it bumped, or why, or what, or for. It bumped the children mainly, and I'll tell you this quite plainly, it bumps them every day, and more, and more, and leaves them dead, and burned, and dying, thousands of them sick, and crying, because when it bumps, it's very, very sore. There is a way to stop the ball. It isn't very hard at all. All it takes is wisdom. And I'm absolutely sure we could get it back into the box and bind the chains and lock the locks. But no one seems to want to save the children anymore. Well, that's the way it all appears. Because it's been bouncing round for years and years and in spite of all the wisdom wisdom since those wondrous days of yore and the time they came across the box bound up with chains and locked with locks and labeled kindly do not touch it's warm